Hi, my name is Gaurav Harish and I'm an audio solution specialist at Avid. Track presets is something that I use all the time and combining it with folder tracks, it makes it an even more powerful function within music production. For example, I have a Machina preset which I can pull up that is saved with the output of each sample of Machina being routed to an input of an aux channel in Pro Tools. I will now put all of these tracks into a basic folder and right click the folder and save this as a new track preset. A great way of working if you are used to using a grid editor function is by creating a MIDI grid editor and saving this as a track preset. You can set this up by creating 8 MIDI tracks for each drum and setting each MIDI track to a single note mode by right clicking on the small keyboard to the right of the track name and selecting octave, C1 for kick, D1 for snare and so on. The note that you set it on depends on the virtual instrument which you are using. Now set your grid to 1 16th notes and you can use a pencil tool to create the drum pattern. To route MIDI to your virtual instrument, insert the virtual instrument and AUX input and set the output of the MIDI tracks to the VI. Finally, select all the tracks and place them in a basic folder and save this as a track preset. Thank you for watching this video on folder tracks. 